Hi everyone, it's Lori from Quilting in the Country. I thought I would share a couple of things I found today Um, going through some stuff of mine and they're kind of cute and I don't know. Um, my grandfather made them years ago. He probably, he passed I think in 2013. Um, come from a family of sewers, right? Uh, not so much quilters. So this he made, and what it is, is just a yardstick that he cut, as you can see, with a a little um, clothespin at the top. And it's supposed to sit in here, and it used to. Um, it was glued. I tried to glue it today, and it did not work. Um, so... I think I'll ask my husband if he can nail it. Um, and what I used to use it for was the directions for um, patterns, you know, when you're when you're garment sewing. But I I don't do a lot of that anymore. Um, but it would be great for my to do list, which you can see right here. I'm rocking it almost. Well, the quilt maker mystery is almost done. And those scrappy back, backings, well, they're going to carry into next week. But wouldn't it look cute right there, tucked up there next to my sewing machine, you know? So I always have my to-do list. Anyway, so that's that. I'm going to have him ask him if he can fix that somehow, like nail it. Um, hammer, I, I, I'm not doing the hammer thing. I'll do the glue thing, but not the hammer thing. Um, the next thing is kind of funny. Now, back in the day, um, I used to crochet a lot with Tim's grandma, the color Mimi. Um, and she always made these doilies. And she taught me how. And I just love them. I mean, they're very old-fashioned. This one isn't even starched. It, it was washed, but not starched. Um, cause they're supposed to be really stiff, but this is called a pineapple doily and this is the pineapple part, right? Well, you use this very thin, um, cotton to crochet these with a tiny hook. Um, so he made this for me, <laughs> which is so funny, but oh my gosh, it's, it's delightful. If you do this kind of thing, it's awesome. And all it is, is. Just a piece of wood with an old cheap, and I mean cheap, uh, toilet paper roll, right? <laughs> and it's screwed right to the bottom, which is awesome. It's just like toilet paper. Over or under, what do you prefer? Um, that way you're not chasing your, chasing your crochet thread all over the place. Um, so that's the other gift my grandfather gave me uh so we have that and this um they're just quirky gifts but useful just thought you'd like to see them and i thought i'd share so have a great day night whatever um don't forget to subscribe and like the video gifts from grandpa or pa as we called him um, anyway, enjoy. Talk to you later. Take care. Bye-bye.